Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Play Mother 3, Tondagasa, and all that jazz. So, here's the jealous face once again. I ground up a little bit, but not, probably not enough to fight back. Because I'm only level 17. But we will see just how well we can go on this, shall we? Alright, now I need... Sprinting bomb. I went off screen and bought a couple sprinting bombs also. Because of the jam session attack, that's ridiculous. Sprinting bomb will clear them out. Except for the one drummer. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to focus here. This is ridiculous. This boss is... After you defeat his band session members, as you saw, he fucking still does the solo jam session. And he starts using hypnosis and fucking powering up, and it's just ridiculous. Ooh, it's a good opportunity. Once you hit twice, you can only debuff and buff twice each. So once you hit twice, don't worry about buffing them at all. Yeah, now we're talking. Ow! Fucking... I think smash hits. Everybody, the bass stopped moving. Drop the bass, bitches. 1352 XP. Level 18. This is now 19. Oh my gosh, she left twice. 11, 4, 2, 1, 3. Awesome. Get out of here. There's a hole if you can jump down from try to jump down. Yes. Alright, let's continue this bad boy. Oh, holy crap. Hey, what's up? What took you so long? Anyways, I just finished explaining everything to the band members. 
Tondagasa. Who are you? He's the one I was talking about just now, Hunter. You two know each other. Hunter, is it true that I don't even remember my real name? But I've lived my life as Lucky for years now. Okay, alright, Lucky. I hate to ask, but can you tell him everything you remember too? Yeah, right. I can definitely tell that something very important is taking place here. I had absolutely no memory whatsoever from before I came to Club City, but I know who I'd be or where I was, where I came from, or where I was going. But for some reason, I was clutching a strange egg with great care. I didn't know where I was going, yet I continued to walk desperately. All I knew was that the egg was really important. I absolutely knew I had to keep it safe, so I looked for a place to hide it. And then, after walking and walking and walking, I buried the egg in a dirt clod in the valley where I knew no one would ever find it. I still know where it is, I haven't forgotten. You go up a cliff near the giant waterfall and... Unknown Valley. That's it. The egg we all search hard to protect is there. Let's go right now. But am I really Hunter? If I am this Hunter person, that means I'll have to leave the band, right? Hunter or Lucky, one of them will cease to exist after today. Right? If it turns out that I'm Hunter, what happens to the CMC? What if I continue to live in Lucky, then what happens to the egg thing? What should I do? It's just... Uh, of course you can't. All you can do is ask Destiny, Barrow E.B. Yeah. If Destiny decides it, I'll say goodbye to you with a smile on my face. Destiny, huh? Yeah, that's, that's Destiny. We have a way. The same thing we've done whatsoever, and everyone's sure we're not to do. We main rock, paper, scissors, but stone sheet clippers, huh? Rochambeau, baby. Yep. This Jersey fellow play Rochambeau with all of us. If he beats all five of us, you'll go. But if he loses even one, he'll stay in DMC and keep on playing the bass. How's that sound? Weapon roll, huh? I'm cool with that. You there. You're okay with that, right? Okay, well, we're ready to begin when you are. You can start with any one of us. Alright, now. This is actually somewhat of a puzzle, but not really. If you talk to this guy, whenever me, Magic, and Bakio play Stone Sheet Clippers, we always end in a tie. Let me get the last one to go. After all, I am the band leader. So, they all end in a tie, so whatever he is, for the most part, everyone does the specific first move of playing this game. Explains why Bakio loses to Magic. Ready to go? No. Have faith in destiny. Bakio, Shimmy almost always starts with stone. It's up to you whether you believe that or not. You ready to go? No. And then Magic here. I always wind up tying whenever I play Stone Sheet with Shimmy. Alright. So, basically, Bakio... Isn't that right? Bakio loses to magic. So Bakio loses to magic. And Bakio and Shimmy always uses ties with him. And Shimmy starts with stone. So if Bakio loses a is copying wait. Shimmy copies with that guy magic. And he loses with Shimmy. Bakio uses stone, which means Shimmy uses stone, this guy uses scissors. Wait, no. He uses paper. No, the guy does use stone. So you'll just pick whatever that guy does. You pick rock. Yeah, there we go. I lose. Lucky is with you. And you come over here, just talk to her. I want to have faith in destiny. Talk to the puppy dog. What's up, bro? Woof, woof. Boy, I'm thirsty. Alright. What did he say again? Never mean magic. Magic and Bakio play. Just don't you always tie. So, magic and Bakio still, so these all guys use rock. Which means you use paper. Yeah. So, basically, what happens here if you mess up, they'll be like, it's one of those butt down my situations. They'll be like, oh, I, I blinked or I didn't do that. Magic. So whenever Magic, Lucky, and the band leader play, 
So magic was the one down there, and that means you always end up a tie, which means once again. See, he sneezes, and he picked the wrong one. Stone Sheet Clippers. See, looks like I lose. Guess he's telling me to lose. Talk to this guy. I want to trust in destiny. If it's my destiny to go, then I'm sure he'll win. And if not, my destiny he'll lose, and I'll stay here. As simple as that. Okay, then. Do Clippers. I'm going to do Sheet. Time to toss. All right, here we go. Stone Sheet Clippers. You heard Lucas right there say go. So this is destiny. I guess Loki probably is this Hunter guy after all. Mind you, I believe OJ knows that Hunter is uh, Lucky's Hunter. Which means I have no reason to stay here anymore either. Haha, <laughs> Lucky. No, Hunter. You are the greatest bass player ever. I'm gonna miss you, man. I hope we meet again someday. I sure we will. Look, we'll forget the time you spent with us now, you dig? Lucky. I still don't remember anything, but I'll come with you guys anyway. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna join your party. Back in the saddle, baby. Yep, I need something. Anyone save the game? Save. Alright. Now Hunter's back here. out of here. Oh, but I feel feverish right off the bat. Oh, dear lord. I took care of the bodyguards. Let's go. Hell yeah! The team's all here. Now, a note to make before we end off this episode here is that Everyone basically starts off at their same level as before. So Hunter was 18 when we left him off, and now he's 18 again. Kumatora was 16 when we left her off, so she's still 16. And they have all the equipment that they had on. And that's about it. So before we leave, actually, let's pick up that, that DMC outfit. You unlock the door. Alright, let's get out of here. What is it? There's someone on stage. I'll leave this music off so you guys can leave. Bon voyage, amigo. Oh, guy in the sky, please grant to give to a friend who's much set out. Much time we wasted laughing together. When the night's gone, the night's gone. My gosh, people. They're gonna play us off. So, as DMC plays us off, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Catch you guys later.